when we pulled up to that beautiful theater in Willie, West Virginia, there was a huge crowd outside. People were chanting my name. It was a little crazy. I felt like Justin Bieber for a minute. Think about that. See, girls, that's what I try to tell you. You're the Abby Lee Dance Company. Everybody knows who you are. They expect greatness. So you can't be one bit less on stage today. The pressure is on. This is the first competition of the new season. And every one of these girls needs to realize that I am looking for new talent. So they better prove to me that they want to be part of the Abby Lee Dance Company, that they want to win. I don't know, Nia. Your mom was pretty pushy. As Abby opens up the Woo! box of costumes, I just see that glimmer of yellow. I know it's a winning costume. I just want Nia to prove to Abby, prove to herself, prove to everyone that she's worked hard, she's an amazing dancer, and she really deserves this solo. So you're doing your job, your job is out there to go out and show, bring a win home for Abby and do your personal best. Abby said you got it. You can do it. Ladies and gentlemen, next up to the stage will be number 116. This is a preteen jazz trio. This is so fast and it's so hard. Don't be nervous, guys. We have to do this. We can do this. Kendall missed booty camp. That was a slap in the face to everyone. Kendall needs to prove herself worthy of the Abby Lee Dance Company. She needs to lead this trio to a victory. Please welcome Chloe, Paige, and Kendall dancing to Buffalo. just like the star that she is. I can only hope that this trio scores well because Abby will never stop punishing Kendall for missing booty camp unless these kids win.